Hey everybody, it's Dave Neal with my beautiful wife, Tasha Courtney. Hello. And boy, have we got some news for you. So we started recording some diary-like videos for your consumption about possibly being pregnant. That's what this first video is, is us going to the doctor and finding out, hey, do these pregnancy tests actually work? Are we doing this thing? Or is this, uh, you know, a dollar store, 10 year old pregnancy test <laughs> that got the info wrong. She had too many salt and vinegar potato chips. Uh, we don't know, we don't know, right? So anyway, you're about to watch that. I don't want to spoil it for you, but chances are you know the direction that this is going. Um, the audio is going to get better. On some of these videos, we were just recording with the GoPro, and then in hindsight, I looked at it and I said, oh boy, we need better production value if we're going to be making a baby. But either way, I hope you enjoy. I hope you can stick around for the different announcements. We're going to do a gender reveal. We s still don't know, a surprise having a baby either way <laughs> how are you gonna well, spoil I'm, it in it's, the intro the thumbnail is gonna say are we pregnant question mark and you're about to find out how about you just say are we pregnant question mark you're about to find out and that's the all right intro. you say that are we pregnant question mark you're about to find out <laughs> <laughs> done you see folks that's called hollywood she stepped on the line she delivered it she's a pro all right that's it we don't know if Tasha's pregnant. I mean, I think we're 90% sure. She tested positive for having a baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's a weird way she did. We she, have two positive pregnancy tests. But I didn't react to them. A, I had an edible. And B, I would, I, that's how I respond to, to things, I guess, is I freeze. I was like, What does it mean? What does it mean? Not? Is it a not? What does that mean pregnant? Does it mean pregnant? Oh, what? What are you thinking? I don't know. Are you nervous? I'm very stressed out. Why are you stressed out? Why are you stressed out? I love you. We'll check again in <laughs> a few minutes. She's nervous. I haven't looked yet. Don't look yet. He's the one closest to us. Ready? On the count of three. <laughs> I felt like you reacted. Did, did you look at the positive test before I did? So here's what happened. I peed on the first stick and you have to like aim, you have to pee on it so i was like aiming at it right immediately the first blue line popped up and that's the blue line that means you're pregnant but i'm like ah uh, i mean it maybe it's the kind of thing where like it it lights up right away and then it fades out i don't know so i you know waited the two minutes i went and got you and um so you, were you expecting me to be all, what were you expecting from me? I wasn't expecting you to be anything. I just, <laughs> I thought I would record the moment for posterity. No, I think it's great. I think it's the, my exact reaction, which is, do we, well, do we even believe You were this? like, is this real? And I was like, I don't know. Let me just look at the box. Because not that the kids need any sort of, you know, science class here, but we really haven't tried to have a baby yet. No, we, I mean, yeah, if this is you went uh, on, you for went on, real, this is our first try. You, you went off birth control in July because you forgot. Yeah. And we just said, hey, maybe you and I are just not good at making decisions. I don't think that means we, oh, geez, almost an accent. I don't think that's a bad thing for like us. I just think, you know, clearly it took me a while to propose. Clearly we're not good at decisions. <laughs> and clearly that's okay. Um, and now you're not feeling well. Yeah. So you took the, you take the, 
You take the pregnancy test on Saturday. Yes, Friday. Friday. Friday evening, and it happens to be Labor Day weekend, so the doctor's office is closed tomorrow. But this I'm morning, sure. you're crying in the bathtub. I'm thinking something bad happened. Turns out, do you think you're hormonal? Uh, More that's than how a, pa a positive pregnancy test works, honey. It's testing for hormones. And apparently my hormones are so, so sky high through the roof that it instantly turned the test positive well, I without even waiting the two minutes. So we'll know on Tuesday. Well, hopefully. Hopefully we'll know on Tuesday and then we'll have updates and we don't really get to tell anybody about it because I guess you're not supposed to. And then we'll just have to wait and I'll have to keep my big mouth shut. Fat chance that happens. Babe, but I will say, to. Tasha had a milkshake for breakfast along with a pretty large bowl of potatoes. So, yeah, that was the only thing that sounded good was potatoes. Bring on the pregnancy weight. Woo! I'm already feeling a little bloated myself. Honestly, though, like, you know, I think for a lot of models they like keep working until they start showing a little bit right like i don't know what the average is but i would say three months four months um but this light nausea it's not real heavy nausea but if this gets worse this is gonna be not good <laughs> well i think you'll just have to do whatever feels right for your body but that's our update we may be <laughs> pregnant i think my emotions will i think it's exciting now but also it's kind of like let's just see let's just get it confirmed first we're not like 10 years into trying where we're gonna have some crazy emotions if it didn't happen it's like let's just see if it is happening it's gonna speed up a lot of decision making we're not gonna stay where we live you know, we've been wanting to buy a home, but we've been, you know, just keeping a cautious eye on it. Lots of things are going to be happening in the next six months uh, if this is what's going down. So, <laughs> hey, that's good. Sometimes you need a little catalyst uh, <laughs> to get you going, and we might just have to set. You know, I think it's, um, I, I feel a lot of peace. I think you missed the exit, no? Oh, oh, no. Okay. I feel a lot of peace because our mantras the past couple years has been everything in perfect timing and I would never have expected that we would get pregnant on our first try. Um, oh, you know what the annoying part is? What? That a psychic told you you're going to get pregnant this year. <laughs> That's the most annoying, <laughs> ugh, I swear. <laughs> the psychic said so. <laughs> no, Did but she say I you were going to get pregnant this year or have a baby this year? Because you're not having a baby in 2023. She's not pregnant. Okay. Uh, um, the due date would be around our birthdays. Which would be a nice little May soiree. Um, anyway, back to what I was saying, which was we, our mantra has been everything in perfect timing. So I'm just trusting that this is perfect timing for us. Tesla, and next thing you know, we're having a baby. We did buy the big one because we wanted room for a car seat. There you go, folks. All right, more updates to come. So this is not for folks, this is for us. This is for us and you who's listening who wants to buy us a baby present. <laughs>